Dogecoin NF2 Joe Welcome back to our channel. Don't miss to strike a like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Then let's discuss the seven NFT games with highest profits. Kangaroo Punch Club Kangaroo Punch Club is a unique play-to-earn game of 3D-drawn kangaroos unleashed to fight in the metaverse with NFTs designed by The Grinch and Minions artist Eddie Tavis. Each 3D NFT character will be built with a sophisticated variety of distinctive traits on the Ethereum blockchain. Become a powerful manager of fighting champions. Buy your fighter, train them, and make them participate in big tournaments. Make your investment grow and see the price of your NFTs boost in the market. You can then generate income from the tournaments, win or sell your kangaroo to obtain profits and invest in new champions. Only one NFT is required to access tournaments. The goal is to face the other kangaroo in the ring during tournaments, win various rewards and thus become the undisputed champion. To do so, you will first need to train your champion. Each kangaroo has its own characteristics at the start. It's up to you to train it or improve its equipment to make it progress. The stronger your character is, the higher the chances of winning. But it's not 100%, just like a real boxing match. More features will be added too in the future to improve the gameplay. Every NFT comes with an exclusive membership to the NFT Boxing Club, boxing's biggest money-making championship. Kangaroo Punch Club will be having whitelist giveaways often on their social media platforms. Do follow them to get yours. Ready to win the title? So step into the ring. All links in the description below. Nomad Exiles Nomad Exiles is an exciting free-to-play crypto RPG game with different multiplayer mechanics. The project is based on a play-to-earn monetization model which allows players to earn in the game. The game genre is sci-fi with elements of medieval setting, Dune, Star Wars, etc. The developers came up with a unique visual style combining the culture of South American tribes such as Aztec and Mayan with the special cyberpunk subgenre, Crystal Punk, where crystals are the core of technological progress. In Nomad Exiles, there's a lot of mechanics for entertainment and income. Playthrough of story quests, independent exploration of secrets and mysteries of the post-apocalyptic world in vast locations, battling with other players in the arena, training and breeding the pets, building and protection of your shelter, trading on the in-game NFT market, and much more. Nomad Exiles will be having their private round on March 17th and initial game offering on March 18th, both on c Launchpad. Do remember to take part and follow all their social media platforms too. All links in the description below. Phantom Pad Before we go to more games, you guys must check out Phantom Pad. Phantom Pad has developed the first hybrid incubator decks built on the Phantom Network, creating a safer, seamless environment for all emerging projects. With the Phantom Pad ecosystem, you can now raise your capital in an easy, safe, and decentralized environment that is completely community-driven. Transition your project from incubation directly to the next step, DEX, and launch your project and investments into outer space with the greatest hybrid incubation DEX model on the planet. Did I also mention that you can earn rewards by staking your FPAD tokens to help secure the ecosystem? Choose your staking preference, start earning with a few clicks, and use your staked funds as collateral on DeFi. Do check out Phantom Pad now. All links in the description below. Mer4 this is an action-style RPG game that has taken the NFT community by storm. Mer4 is a full-blown action RPG with great story elements and amazing graphics, and it is formatted for mobile gameplay. This is a game that you can play not only on both mobile styles, but also on PC. This is a free-to-play game, so you can download this game for free and start playing. It is NFT and crypto play-to-earn enabled, but until you reach level 40, it's not a play-to-earn game. So it prevents people from coming in and just spamming and botting, mining all the cryptocurrency and selling it. Then there'd be no profit for the people actually playing to earn, so there's a gate. You have to get to level 40 before you can start doing that. But once you do, you can start mining the in-game currency or the in-game metal, which can then be converted into crypto. The game in general has a pretty good economy already going right now. It's a lot of fun to play. Upland Upland is a blockchain-based game in which players can buy, sell, and trade their virtual properties mapped into the real world. This certifies the users as digital landowners and allows users to build properties on their land and earn UPX coins. 
The project uses blockchain technology to tie down each property within the Upland platform to an NFT. What sets it apart from other popular blockchain-based games is that Upland is seeking to create a market-based digital economy that seeks to further blur the line between the real world and the digital world. Users can purchase digital assets in the Upland platform using fiat or cryptocurrency, or even using the UPX coin, and trade their assets with fellow players. This program is known as the Property to USD Beta Program. It has recorded top sales of around $1,000 US dollars per piece. Since its launch, Upland's players have spent around $29,250 US dollars on property in the Upland metaverse, with the average spend being $39.50 per player. Light Knight Light Knight is a multiplayer third-person shooter game with in-game rewards and a minimalistic, slender, and cartoonish design reminiscing of the good old arcade games. The developers offer several gaming modes like Team Deathmatch or Battle Royale game mode for solo quest and squads team play. Players will receive Bitcoin instantly as they shoot their opponents. All the in-game items have a real value that players can consume or trade to withdraw their balance using Lightning Network. Light Knight has opted for a freemium circular economy model with an in-game store where the players can purchase and sell their premium items. The native currency of the game is Supercharged Lightning Network to allow instant payout for the players. The assets have superpowers through Liquid Sidechain, level up your gaming experience by personalizing your character using the various skins and accessories available in the in-game store. Light Knight runs in the Elixir ecosystem. Elixir is a Bitcoin-based gaming platform developed by Satoshi's Games in 2021. Elixir has managed to combine the joy of playing games while earning Bitcoins every time we play. It has its own Bitcoin NFT marketplace where users can sell their in-game skins to earn more Bitcoins. Spider Tank Game Dia, based in the Netherlands, designed and developed Spider Tanks, a PvP brawler. Spider Tanks is a free-to-play game with a number of play-to-earn mechanics, including skill-based competition, resource collection, and a player-driven upgrade cycle. This game is still in its early stages of development and is likely to launch somewhere in the midst of 2022. Spider Tanks surely has a huge potential of exploding in the NFT marketplace. This game makes use of cutting-edge blockchain technology to give every player the ability to earn. Spider Tank's unique combination of play-to-earn mechanics will allow everyone to participate regardless of their approach to the game. There will be several ways to participate and each will play an important role in Spider Tank's groundbreaking PDE economy. Players can take on a variety of exciting roles such as pilot, captain, emperor, or even fabricator. Each character will have a distinct role that contributes towards the excitement of the game. This expertly crafted and brilliantly competitive game will be the world's first globally recognized play-to-earn eSport. In fact, the first Spider Tanks maps are now available for pre-order only while supplies last. The game will feature incredible graphics, powerful firepower, and a high level of excitement for battles. Which of these games do you like the most? Do let us know. Also, before investing, do contact your financial advisor. Before leaving, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video.